welcome back to Oxygen Not Included. This is James with House of Gamers. And last time I said we were going to work on the plumbing, and I've done a lot of plumbing off camera. And this is kind of what I've got as of right now. It's not really a lot of work. I mean, it is a lot of work, but it's not... It's not all done, it's not all completely organized the way I want it to be. Um, but it, it's functioning. I'm just dumping all of my water up here. And as you can see, I'm dumping my, my toilet water that's been filtered. And the steam that's coming from up here, it's all coming down in uh, water form with slime lung in it because there's still slime lung in the air which is fine because now that I have it coming over here uh, I've done this part of as part of plumbing off camera uh, now that I've done this all of the germs die off before it even becomes oxygen um, before it even gets dumped into our tank over here it's just all it just all becomes clean so that works I'm not too worried about that um, not that we're using water for consumption anyway so it doesn't really matter at the end of the day but the fact that the water is coming out cool at a, at a cool 40 40 degrees is what uh, is what's really making the difference. And down here, I've still got this running too. I do have the thermo aqua tuner running to speed things up a little bit. Um, you can see that that does drain us on power quite a lot. But I, I had to turn it back on because we were running out of water down here, and I don't want this uh, slime to start putting off into the air. Not that it's a big deal, but because there's already a bunch of slime in the air anyway outside. Uh, as far as the power goes, I simply made an oopsie, and I'm sure it was probably caught on, on video by anyone watching anyway. Um, we had not hooked up the heavy conductive wire back up to this joint plate because uh, if you remember last time we had a joint plate here and here because I had to move one uh, and just never never bothered to connect them up so that's why our batteries weren't getting any power so we just kind of wasted a bunch of natural gas doing that but uh, it is it is what it is um, as far as running out of natural gas here it's probably going to happen soon if I don't turn this thermal aqua tuner off. Because it is indeed taking up a lot of power. So we're going to just turn that off. And we might expand our tanks back even further than they already are. Because this, this geyser goes off for a long time long time and we're, we're really still not getting all of the natural gas that we could be out of it and then there's this whole other one up here too that I'm just currently using as a backup geyser for just in case um, so I think now what we're gonna do is work on gas um, I did of course put this in here for more oxygen production and it's going through this area right here for any possibility of having slime lung in it whatsoever so it gets extra extra clean uh, and speaking of slime lung that's what we're going to do is we're going to uh, set up a cleaning chlorine room um, the only thing that's going to put us back is that we don't have plastic. Now, we could remedy this by simply digging down. We could uh, oh, we could go grab this this glossy Draco and that would give us some plastic which 
we don't need a lot for the starting of that. And that's actually that's exactly what we're gonna do. We're just gonna dig down and grab this glossy draco. And while they're doing that, we'll go ahead and set up a sort of blueprint area for our cleaning of the air. And I'm going to kind of try to do this in just in a, in my own kind of way. I'm not going to follow anyone else's plans. I'm just going to try to work with what I got. Because sometimes, sometimes you just got to be original. So we'll definitely need a gas reservoir. And a, uh, well, probably two gas reservoirs for that matter. And leave a space for a, which should be your priority eight like I want them to be. Um, this needs to be priority nine. We want the air or gas shut off and let's see. If it's not clean, it's going to go back into the system. And we're actually going to use three tanks, three tanks instead of two, because I want to have that extra uh, extra space for the air to get clean or gas in general. So we'll put a pipe that goes in up here, and of course we'll come out back down here. If it is clean, it'll go into this tank. And we'll come back out up here. Uh, we'll just stick it right in here for now so that it goes goes through here just in case something does happen to mishap and we're not able to control it. Uh, let's see. We will want to, of course, vacuum this room out so well, instead of doing that there we'll do we'll just put the vacuum here and That like that. And have this here. Can we do that? Yeah, okay. So we can do that. Um, gas pipe element sensor here. Or gate because I want to be able to toggle it. So this or a lever outside, which we'll just put here, and that will go up there. That way we can control control the flow of gas. Mm. We'll hook that up to that as well. Or not. 
actually. We'll have a do this instead because that just is a waste we'll just turn the actual pump off instead that'll be how we do it and then we can seal this off like so Honestly, we could make it more flush if we wanted to, but uh, that's okay. And we can't actually put that ladder in like that. We're gonna get this done. Get that glossy draco. Did we get the glossy draco? We did. Okay. Did they wrangle him and put him in here? No. Oh, they can't reach him because he's being weird. So we'll do this. So that he can't get away. So that there's no place that he can run. Haha. Uh -huh. Can't get away from me. He probably will. Got a whole lot of chlorine. I want to start cleaning out what's in these tanks up here too. Uh, but we can't do that right now. I don't want to risk putting it down here and it not getting clean by the time it's out. Um... I know that's a long journey, it's a lot of chlorine, but I don't want to risk that for my base. I don't want to risk them breathing in a bunch of slime lung. Not that we couldn't cure it, because we definitely can. You know, these are full to the brim. Hit <laughs> that long line. Uh, that's crazy. But at least we know we've got food in the mess halls in the or the med base. Uh, oh, I disabled these a long time ago and never re-enabled them. Doesn't really do much good, does it? All right, let's. We haven't really done anything with slicksters, although we haven't really gotten any oil either. Did I turn this off? I did, didn't I? Yeah, I did. Hopefully, this will be enough to keep this water going because I've got water coming from here and from here from up here this is getting significantly colder than that over there I think I think I have this set to 60 because it's not it's not bad the stuff that's coming through here is not really that bad uh, 70 I have it to come in below 70 um, that might change. We might start to see stuff in the water, but as of right now, it's clean. If we if we happen to come across that, we'll uh, 
We'll we'll burn that bridge when we get there. And they still haven't wrangled this Draco because he is being evasive. Annoyingly so. All right, somebody come grab this thing. Anyone? No? All right, fine. Either they'll grab it, or this one will incubate. Let's see, what else can we do while we're here? We can do. We'll do the valve miniaturization. And you know. No way. Another one? We have too many as is. I guess I shouldn't complain. It's free power. Because we'll make another power plant. Oof, that's crazy. That's just straight craziness. Um, I would like to see some other stuff. We have this carbon dioxide geyser. I could probably use that with um, slicksters. We've got all this that we can still dig out have been digging out. Not can still. We are. We have been. Um, something else that we could do while they're doing that is we could have a kiln going. Do that over mm. You know what? I want to do it in a nice place. We could have our whole base. I didn't think about this. We could put gold here. Gold here. Gold here. How about the carpeted tiles? I mean, it doesn't really matter. This is made out of gold. Right? Decor plus 15. Could have everything in the base be We don't have any more. Um, Alright, I guess I don't have any more chlorine in here. Alright then. There's a lot of stuff in here. So that's a bit gold it is. Gold everything. Take this down now, I guess. Let's not do all. Let's do the buildings first. We'll start with the buildings. And the gas pipe can come after that. We're not using this now. He's scalding. Oh, you know, I didn't think about how hot the gold was. Cancel that, because the gold is really hot. I didn't think about that. <laughs> It'll cool off over time, right? These, these will cool off because there's wheat wear here. And 
you know what, actually, we've got the carpet, well, we've got the stuff to make the carpet, so let's just carpet the bedroom. Stop it. We're done. We're not doing this. Poor, poor Sapper Sam. You go. Take a little snoozle. Take a little. Actually, this would be better, right? Properties. Uh, right? This does better for physical injuries. Or does only physical entries. Plumber chamber, plumber chamber decreases patients' disease recovery time. Okay, so no, it cannot heal physical injuries. So it's only for diseases. 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 Uh, nobody, still nobody's gone to get this Draco. It's fine. We'll get there when we get there. More Draclid eggs. It's good for me. Great to have a glossy directlet egg. A great start. Let's see. Yeah, that got really hot really quick. I'm not surprised. It's 90 degrees, 100 degrees a year. Well, alright, let's look at the power. Deconstruct that. Deconstruct that. These little bits and bobs. Um, what else is there too that's doing that? Whoa, 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 whoa. Calm down. That deconstruct this for now because we don't actually want them to be bringing in the hot stuff. We'll have them use what's already in here. It's gonna turn off what? No, really not that much, honestly. Have them deconstruct all of this. to have all of this built up. Actually, yeah, that can stay. That can stay. This can go here. Because they'll, they'll get that done eventually. As of right now, it's not a big deal. Um, I would like them to get this done, and I'm hoping that this will help in the oxygen production enough that uh, we can keep up with the atmo suits and various other things because yeah we're filling up the base now but we are using a lot of water to do this which means that it honestly might be necessary in the long run to make more power more efficient power I guess I can always just dig all this out it's probably about time that I actually make a physical tank for the water to be quite honest let's go from here here all the way over to here like so oh, mushroom that's a mushroom that's what's blocking my way. And we took out all the railing here, I think. Oh, uh, no, we almost did. Uh, deconstruct all the buildings here. Uh, can deconstruct this and this. Dig out this. Um... Them. Just go down and dig out this. And 
That'll be like that. Okay, so actually, while they're also doing other things, I should explain what I did with the plumbing. Because I have yet to do that. So basically what I've done is I've given everything a section. And all those sections go up to a shutoff that have a switch over here. And the reason I did this that, uh, that way is because I'm very peculiar about stuff. So if I want to make a new bathroom, if I want to move a bathroom that I have, I can... And I have two bathrooms that are on two separate sections so that if I do shut one down and decide to move it somewhere else, it won't leave the duplicates without a bathroom. Uh, that's kind of the, the big reason why I did it. And like I said, uh, there's still there's a lot of plumbing going on. And it's still not quite as organized as I would like it to be, but it's definitely a lot better than it was before. And that is what really matters. And these are filling up. And I can tell this to just... Uh, yeah, we'll just tell this to go Where's my dump valve? Here? Yeah? Alright, because that's filling up We'll just tell them to Put that right There We'll have to do that because we don't want confusion as well as or not not really not that oh no there there this will just dump the clean water into this up here so that it can be recycled and cleaned yeah, goodness gracious this whole huge area full of oxygen we're actually slowly, slowly sipping, seeping out to this vacuum here, which is fine. Um, yeah, just so you guys know, I'm actually really tired. Um, running on four hours of sleep, but I wanted to get this episode recorded so that I could have it out on time. Uh, that's done. So we can do this. And... We can do... This. And please don't trap yourself in there. That would not be cool. How's this coming over here? There's that. Did anyone ever come get the Draco? It's here. Did someone come? Is someone gonna come and get it? That's probably a pretty good reason why they didn't drop it off yet. If someone could do that, that would be great might put another airlock here I don't know yet I would like to have definitely would like to have plastic by now but that might might take a wee, wee bit longer anyway I'm gonna let them get this done this gas thing done and hopefully by the time we come back we'll have some uh, plastic we'll get some of these glossy dracos into the stable and shear them and and that'll just basically tell the printing pod that we can get plastic so we'll probably do that and then we'll come back all right so the room is done we managed to get some plastic uh, 
block so we can put the germ element sensor in here now as well as a high pressure gas vent for our chlorine uh, let's see turn this on and we, we have some chlorine in this tank down here that we're just gonna pump into the room um, we'll probably use the chlorine that's in here uh, shove it in here as well eventually but our big our big whoop right now is absolutely the germ sensor now um, while we were waiting for the plastic and other stuff I went ahead and kind of automated this so now there's dirt and whatnot um, that can be taken out of this and it is allowed manual use so I don't know oh because it was probably it was clicking was on nine we went on one it needs to be the lower of the priority of things that are here um, have all of our cleaners clean out of that after they sleep sure have a little shine bow print out why not I definitely got all this carpet built it's good except for one tile and their decor is out the roof in there uh, let's see let's look at the vitals everybody's morale is up pretty high Ruby's at 29 mediocre decor Um, okay, let's look at the oxygen. Uh, oxygen production could be better up here. We got carbon dioxide built up over here. And the bathroom. Um, I know why that is already. I don't need to be, I'm not really all that worried about it. Um, they can go use the bathroom with carbon dioxide, it doesn't take them long. Uh, the buildup over here is not really that big of a deal either. It's eventually going to fall through. Make its way down here. Eventually. So now we're just waiting on them to build this. And let's see. that so if it's below one germ that will activate the pipe there's no reason for you to go in here anymore ever again um, while that's active we're good to go so this will pump it out once this becomes a vacuum we'll turn it off um, I would say allow me to use on that, but I don't really want them to because their hands are going to be dirty. What did you just take? Also, a better question is, are they emptying this? Yes, they did empty that. Okay. Uh, let's deconstruct this and put in an actual sink or we could do something even better and use a hand sanitizer station we have hydrogen in here why where is it coming from Why? Where? Why are we getting hydrogen? Why are we getting hydrogen built up? Question mark. 
That's bizarre. What just happened? That was weird. What? What did I just do? I neglected to do, I guess, is a better terminology for that. Uh, you. Start bringing in. Yeah, do that. I'm not sure how I managed to do that, but. Uh, well, now we have hydrogen in our. in our mid bay. Um. I mean... It's fine. For now. No one's hurt. No one's getting hurt. Um... Cancel that. That was really bizarre. I wonder when I did that. Bizarre. All right. Um, it's getting pretty close to being a vacuum. Speak of the devil. All right, we'll turn that off. And then we'll attach this down here. Not do anything till you turn it off, Lou. Anybody? Anybody? Thank you. Here we go. Now that hydrogen can go in there. And to test this theory, we'll put a gas pump right here. Go ahead and make a save because I'm not playing an Iron Man mode. I'll go back if I have to. If my uh, computer will cooperate with me. Okay. All right. Hmm. Give her some power from this line. Is that all the, all the chlorine we had in that? I mean, I guess so. Because they're still cleaning stuff over there. Uh, yeah, this has 9,000 slime lung germs in it. So the goal is if it's below one germ, this will activate. If it's above one germ, it won't. And it'll just sit in here until, well, oh, you know, I didn't think about this. But we might have to do a gas shutoff here and do the same thing we did down there with the water. We'll see. We'll see how this goes. Worst comes to worst, we'll let the chlorine out and pump more in later. Um, or what we could do is 
have a clock sensor here and just allow it to, to run for a certain time of day that'll that'll work say turn on at night and then let it clean air throughout the major cycle that'll that'll work pretty well I think well I'm actually running out of time so I'm gonna get this set up might play around with it get it to where we need it first and then come back um, I do plan on reorganizing the oxygen and all the ventilation and stuff so that it's not so cluttered and, and messy and whatnot and um, yeah I'll get back to it and I will see you guys in the next episode if you liked the video please hit that like button if you really loved it and I earned your subscription please subscribe Till next time guys, this has been James and I'm out.